Good afternoon, YouTube! Digital Adele here with another Hoops Profile. This time we have UCLA's own Amari Bailey, the 19-year-old 6'5 point guard. He averages 11.2 points per game, 3.8 rebounds per game, 1.1 steal per game, 49.5% from the field, 38.9% from three. Wow! 69.8 from the free throw line, gotta improve that, and 2.4 turnovers per game. His explosiveness is a seven. His ball handling with both hands is an eight. His finish with his left hand is a nine. His finish with his right hand is an eight. His floater is a seven, his jump shot is a nine, his jumper off the bounce is a nine. Mid post a five, offensive IQ is a six, Screen setting a 5, low post game a 5, footwork a 7, passing an 8, rebounding a 6, defensive IQ is a 7, competitive or team defense a 7, competitiveness a 7, and 6 for playing the passing lanes. My notes on Amari Bailey is that he's an excellent ball handler and shooter from the point guard position. He plays competitive defense but not elite. He rebounds okay. He isn't the best decision maker. He over penetrates a lot and tries to dribble through traffic. He needs to make a decision at the free throw line to pass or shoot, and he needs to process these decisions quicker. Let's get into the tape. All right, here's Amari Bailey in the open court with a nice dime to the big man underneath. That was a really nice pass. You can see as he looks off the defender, he just drops a dime on him. If he'd looked to pass first, he'd be such a better player, to be honest. Now here's an example of Amari Bailey coming in on a break and over penetrating like we talked about. As you can see, he's got options. He's got uh, Jaquez down the middle, so Jaime down the middle. Um, there's Amari right there. And he's got these options. He could pass to the wings, but he decides that he's going to not make that pass back there as we talked about the high may or all that space he could throw that ball to high may he decides he's going to dribble in between all these people see there's the foul line where he needs to make a decision to pass or shoot right there and he doesn't so instead he's got one defender there two defenders there three defenders there so there's four people really impacting his play on him. Um, but as I mentioned, he could either kick the ball out to either one of the shooters or to Jaime on the low block who's got a nice seal going on. He could use either one of those options. Uh, he's got to make a decision there instead of trying to dribble through everybody. See here on the break, he drops a nice little dime to Jaime. If he looks to pass first and be a pass first point guard, he's going to be a better player. This is what he does, and this is what feeds into that mentality that he can dribble through everybody. As you can see, there's three guys around him again. We've got the defender on his back. These two defenders there. Somebody's open. There's three people on him. He needs to look to be a pass first point guard. He's past the free throw line, as I mentioned, so he's over penetrated. So he's got to shoot it at this point. Glad at least he, he made the shot. Now look at his defensive rep. Look at him move his feet. Yeah, I like it. His teammate committed the foul, but just watch him. Watch his feet. Fights through that screen. Stays in him chest to chest. He's not an elite defender, but when he's comp he's competitive. He can move his feet. He can slide him. Let's take a look at this uh, rep right here again. He over penetrates. He did it again. We're going to back that up. There's Amari, Amari Bailey right there. He has Jaime on the post again. But instead, he over penetrates. What, what, where's the foul line, people? He's past the foul line. He's 
over-penetrated again. Pass the foul line. You either got to have an angle to shoot or pass the ball if you're going to do that. Nice stroke. He's got such a nice jump shot. Really nice jump shot. He's on balance. There's the beef. He does have a little bit of a dip. But he gets nice elevation and nice high follow through. Snaps that wrist. Beautiful jump shot. Yeah, he's got a beautiful stroke. Now here is a little Amari and Jaime Vasquez two-man disruption on the defensive end. Just watch these two. Watch him work. Amari's got his arms out, making himself big. Jaime, he shoots the gap here to stay connected to his man. Look at Amari fight over that screen. Just making life difficult. Even though he gets a little bit picked off here, he gets right back into the play. And then gets, gets a tip, uses that length. Nice. Really nice defensive rep. Really nice defensive rep. And here's Amari on the break. And this is what I said. When he's a willing passer, man, he makes good passes. And he makes it look easy. Because Jaime starts well behind the three purple shirts of Northwestern. Nice little dime. And he impacted that shot too, stayed on his hip, used his length, made it a tough shot, and it makes a beautiful outlet pass. That guy's got to catch it. That guy's got to catch it. Take a look at this again. His eyes are up. He sees this the whole way. There's Amari Bailey there. Look at his vision. He's looking right at the guy. Sees it the whole way. You got to catch it. You got to catch that. And now this is late shot clock creation. This is a big time shot. At the next level, you're gonna to need to be able to do things like this. And this time he doesn't over penetrate. He stops right at that far line extended elbow area. And he takes that nice little one foot runner. He could have pulled up to shoot his regular jump shot too, but that was a nice shot. Love to see that, I need to see more of that. Here he is, penetrating again. Looked, again to me, over-penetrating. He drew four defenders. Somebody's open. He needs to kick it to the open man. He needs to look to pass the ball more. Here he is. There you go. Now there's two, three people on him. I mean, he was a good shot. He ended up getting a good shot. He just didn't convert. Still would like him to look to be a pass-first point guard a little bit more. Now watch this defensive rep by Amari. Look at him make life difficult for this guy. Hounding him, getting a tip, using his long frame. Yeah, I like it. And that is it for today, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments below about Amari Bailey out of UCLA. Where is he going to go in the draft? What kind of player is he in your mind? Uh, this channel is growing rapidly. I appreciate all the support. Continue to like and subscribe if you would please. Um, I'll see you next time. Take care. Stay safe.